So I'm just going to go over the few camera settings that you can have in Unreal 4 that might make navigation a lot easier. Uh, one of the first ones is obviously you can, there's several ways that you control the camera in Unreal 4. You can use the three mouse uh, buttons uh, that you have. So right click uh, will let you orbit your head, left click will let you go in and out and look around. Holding them both together will let you go up and down and strafe and then your middle mouse will kind of also let you strafe and zoom in and out by scroll wheel. Uh, you can also hold the right click and use WASD to move around like a first person. And a cool feature in this is if you hold down control and do this, you can change how fast you go. Sorry, not control. If you're moving by W, uh, ASD, and you use your mouse wheel to scroll up, you can make yourself go faster, or if I hold, scroll down, I can make myself go slower. So instead of using this icon here for camera speed, you can basically control that by scrolling up and down. Uh, if you press F, it will focus the camera on an object that you have in your level. So that's really handy, especially if you get way zoomed out, you press F. If you're ever outside the world for whatever reason, uh, you can also um, select something in the word outliner and press F and you can focus on that too. Um, you also have the ability to store camera locations. So for instance, if um, I'm playing the game and if I press escape and I want to store this position now my camera's on, I can click on this drop down menu, go to bookmarks and I can say set bookmark uh, 1. Then if I press 1 on my keyboard it will bring the camera directly to that position and as you can see you can have quite a few bookmarks. You can clear them all as well or clear whatever bookmarks that you've made. It's just a really handy way of moving your camera. Another cool thing that you can do is if you're duplicating an object in your scene and you want to move that object uh, with the camera, if you hold down shift and move that object, it'll not only move the object but it'll move your camera along with it. So that's a neat trick too. One last thing on the cameras is if you want to zoom or anything like that, all you have to do is hold down uh, right click and C and V will let you zoom in and out into your scene. Oh, sorry, Z and Z. So Z to zoom in, Z to zoom out. And that's a good thing if you've got like, um, as I do, post process setup where it blurs the closer you get to an object. But if I use uh, C, I can zoom into that object and it won't blur.